How to stand to work a heavy bag. Don't overlook the basics. Get a good workout without injuring yourself by standing properly to work the heavy bag. You will need a stance, technique, movement, and balance. Step one, strike a fighting stance with your feet shoulder width apart. If you are right-handed, align your right toe width but not touching your left heel. Step two, elevate onto your toes, rotating slightly to the right on the balls of your feet, turning your hips and sternum 45 degrees and plant your heels. Rotate to your left if you're left-handed. Prepare by touching a bare fist where you will make contact with the bag with your arm extended. Shadow box a little, bending your knees and striding to gauge your reach. Step three, roll your fingers into your palm and hold your fists at the sides of your face so that your thumbs sit directly under your cheekbone. Turn your knuckles in to keep your pinky knuckles from making contact with the bag, where they could break. Step four, keep your elbows against your rib cage. Raising your elbow away from or too high above your ribs leaves you unprotected as you punch. Recoil each jab on the same plane it was delivered on, pulling directly back to guard again. Step five, move forward, backward, left and right, the lead foot first, the trailing foot always returning to the original position. Tuck your chin and jar the bag with your feet shoulder width apart. Step six, slide using half steps to maintain space between your feet without allowing them to come together or cross over one another. Move with agility, crouching slightly, keeping balanced as you rotate around the swinging bag. Perfect your technique and go for the title. Did you know, the first female boxing matches were staged in London in the 1720s. The women were allowed to use their feet and knees.